everyone okay let's work on this 3 to the power of x multiply by 3 to the power of x multiply by 3 to the power of x equals 30 okay there is something you must understand from here okay this is 3 times 3 I mean 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of x this is not decimal point okay know that now pick one of the bases because they are the same then we add the powers okay because we are to multiply the base we add the powers so we equate to 30 now we are going to have 3 here to the power of 3x now equal to 30 and mind you we can write 30 in this form okay we can only say um, 3 to the power of x is equal to 3 multiplied by 10 right now let's take the log of both sides as we have log 3 to the power of 3x let me put this in brackets right okay so this will now be equal to log log of 3 times 10 now what does the law say about the power the power which is 3x will come behind to multiply the log so 3x will multiply log 3 and then here we apply product um, um, product rule that if you're multiplying like this it equally means that you can have log of the first plus log of the second okay so we we'll continue from here and um, remember that we want to get the value of x to do that i'll first of all divide this by log 3 then the whole of this will be divided by log 3 this will go now 3x here is equal to this is for both of them so i'm going to write log 3 over log 3 plus all right log 10 over log 3 so this would go with this 3x will now be equal to this is not 0 but 1 because 3 log 3 divided by log 3 will give us 1 then we have okay this is addition please we now have log 10 over log 3 by the way we can apply change of base to this so our 3x is 1 plus log 10 over 3 mind you log 10 sorry log 10 to base 3 rather it's the same thing as log 10 over log 3 now remember that we are getting the value of x so i have to divide this by 3 so that x will now be 1 plus log 10 to base 3 the whole of this will be divided by 3 the whole of this will be divided by 3 and if i go ahead x will now be 1 plus log 10 to base 3 the whole of this is multiplied by 1 over 3 because if you have a number times 1 over 3 it is the same thing as that number divided by 3 and it's expected that this appears before this so x will now be 1 over 3 multiplied by 1 plus log 10 log 10 to be 3 okay let's continue okay so from here if we want we can open the bracket as we have 1 over 3 times 1 is 1 over 3 plus 
here we're going to have 1 over 3 log 10 to base 3. Okay, so, and if you remember, this is the power of that. Okay, so if we want to rearrange this, you can write your x to be 1 over 3 plus log 10 to the power of 1 over 3 to the base of 3. So if you like, you can put this together and it's to the base of 3. So this is the value of our x. Now let's verify. We had 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of x equals 30. Now I want to work on one of these. Okay, so if I have any of these now, I will now multiply it by 3. Since we have the same thing in 3 places. We're going to have 3 to the power of x, which is now 1 over 3, plus log 10 to the power of 1 over 3 to the base of 3. Okay, so from here, this is 3 to the power of 1 over 3, multiplied by, I'm using multiplication because we are expected to, to add the powers, right? So we now have log of, okay, I, okay, that is not it. We have 3 to the power of 1 over 3 multiplied by this 3. We'll take this to be its power as well. So we have 3 to the power of log 10 to the power of 1 over 3. Now the whole of this is to the base of 3. Here we have 3 to the power of 1 over 3 multiplied by here we have log to be 3 and 3 so they will go and here we now have 10 to the power of 1 over 3 so this is what we have left now how do we deal with this this is very simple if you are going to add you know to multiply different bases with the same power you can multiply 3 multiply the two bases just as we are going to have 30 then the power will be one of them so we'll pick one of them okay so this is what we have and now one of the three x you know i mean three to the power of x gave us this and we're going to have three to the power of x in three places so i'll just multiply this by three the whole of this will be multiplied by three the whole of this we multiply it by 3. Okay, this is multiplication. And um, meaning that we have this in 3 places. If it's going to confuse you, let's have this in 3 places. Mind you, um, 30 to the power of 1 over 3 is the same thing as square root of 30. So we have um, the same thing as cube root of 30 times cube root of 30 times cube root again of 30 right so let's multiply i know cube root of 30 times cube root of 30 is going to give us 30 to the power of okay okay um cube root of 30 times cube root of 30 will give us 30 to the power of 2 over 3, right? Then multiply by the cube root of 30 again, and that could be 30 to the power of 1 over 3. Now, we'll pick one of the bases as we have 30 again. Then we have 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3. So we have 30. Now the LCM of the power is 3, then 2 plus 1 is 3. So at the end of the day, we have 30 to the power of 1, and that is the same as 30. And that is what we had on the right hand side of the equation. So we are very correct to say that our x is 1 over 3 plus log 10 to the power of 1 over 3. This 
is to base 3. Okay, so this right here, the value of x satisfies the equation.